Hey guys, so this TV here is the Vizio E470VL. Um, this thing was given to me by a neighbor and I had to watch about a thousand videos to get it working. Um, he said it had worked for him, but he gave it to me and it wasn't working. Um, so I did the flashlight test on it and that's where you uh, hold up a flashlight really close to the screen like this and um, you can tell whether or not you have picture back there so um, just to kind of help diagnose your problem so I did have picture um, you can see the Vizio sign when you turn the TV on this would light up white the logo there um, so I knew that the backlight wasn't working everything else was working so <clears throat> back of the TV um, Watched a bunch of videos, um, pulled the back off. In the back here, you got screws all along the edge. You got two long screws here and here on each side. And then there's some small screws that you don't want to miss or you're going to break stuff. These here next to the HDMI and then to the, uh, art, the, the audio out. And then you got another here, just some small ones you don't want to miss. And then actually there's uh, three behind here behind the stand that you don't want to miss too so you got to take the stand off get the back off um, but I opened it up and so if you're looking at the whole TV um, you got your power board here and then over here is your um, your main board so I opened mine up and uh, they were kind of dirty took the power board off to see if I could see any cathodes or diodes or resistors anything you know, swollen or burnt up, anything obvious, and I couldn't. Um, so after almost buying a multimeter and going the whole nine yards and seeing what was not working, I just I read some on a couple forums that uh, you can actually the, the dust can be a conductor and dust and the dust can kind of short out your motherboard and your power board. So I gave it a good cleaning. It did have a bunch of dust on it and uh, uh, slapped it back on and I, and I turned it on and it didn't come on and so I thought I was back to square one but then after leaving it for about a minute or two uh, it started working so now it's working real good get a really good picture um, when it was given to me, I was told the HDMI is none of that worked, but I cleaned out the motherboard real good, cleaned out the power board, and uh, HDMI's work, the TV works. I don't have it plugged in right now, so you just kind of get blank screen, but um, pull up the menu. Everything's working really great, so believe it or not, um, that might be the first thing you want to try, is just pull off that power board. If you do do the flashlight test and you got some picture, pull that power board off and then uh, give it a good cleaning um, and then put it back on there um, again you want to make sure it's not plugged in because uh, it's a lot of voltage you're dealing with so just unplug it let it sit for a little while and then uh, pull that board off get it give it a good cleaning and you know you might get lucky like I did now I got this nice 47 inch TV that uh, that works great so I hope that can be helpful I watched a ton of videos. They're super helpful for me, and I was I was about to break it down to the components, but I'm glad I didn't have to. So try it out. Hopefully, uh, you guys can get as lucky as I did, and uh, good luck.